Car here. Today in Power BI, we're going to be doing slicers for text. So, as you know, in Power BI, if you come over here, let's just minimize the filters pane. If you come over here to the visualizations, we only have one visualization for slicer, and that's, that's this slicer visualization. So, if we wanted to add this and play around with it to see how this works, we'll come here and we will just drop it in here. Now we have to add some information in here as to get this visualization to work. And this right here is just kind of a, a sample of what that will look like. So we're going to add in product category. And now we see our product categories. Then let's just add another fields in our report view. So this visualization is just going to be all the different products. So now we can see all our different products that are in our data table. So if we click on our slicer and just select Apple, and we select Apple, now we get to see how that slicer works in regards to just having apples and it's just displaying all the Apple products. And the same thing if we click on beer, now we see all the different beer products. And the same thing if we click on beef. So now we get to see all the different beef products. In addition to adding just one field to this slicer, we can also add a hierarchy. So if we come here, and let's just say we wanted to have product category and then we wanted our regions here. We can say, all right, let's go for appetizers and then all the different regions. So now we get to see what appetizers, what appetizers sold in the Midwest region. So now we can see appetizers that sold in the Midwest region. We can see appetizers that sold in the North regions south region and the west regions if we wanted to look at two different ones we can hold down control and we can select northeast and west region at the same time we can come here this is going to clear the selection so we can clear our selection here look at all our different product categories again and select multiple different product product categories we can again click on the first one hold down control click on the second one click on the third one as long as you're holding down control you can click through multiple product categories. So if we just click here, it'll take it away, or you can just click on clear selection. In addition to that, if you click on this down arrow, you have a list slicer, then you have drop down slicer. So if we select drop down slicer, now we're able to look at the slicer as a drop down instead of just a big list. And now what you do is you create more space in your report view so that you can add more data information to this. This is just by simply selecting between list and drop down. You get the same effect if you drop down, you come here. Now you got a little scroll and you can click on appetizers. You can still see your appetizers. You can see you can still see your hierarchical data and you can expand it and unexpand it. And a better example of this will probably be something like state so if we just change this back to list and let's just expand this all the way down let's just get rid of product category and region and then let's add in state so as we know we can get all the states and if we click on alabama we see all the products in alabama but what if we wanted to look deeper into this and say well I'm, i want to see alabama but i want to see the cities as well and we can drag in cities as our hierarchy so now we see alabama and all the cities in alabama with different products so we can select off of that now we can just look at mobile we can look at montgomery and we can look at birmingham or we can look at birmingham huntsville and montgomery all together so now you know how to create a slicer for text in power bi